Mum and Dad noticed that uh, I wasn't picking up noises or sounds on my right hand side and uh, I went along to a specialist back then and uh, it was diagnosed I was uh, having a hearing loss. The hearing solutions that I tried um, didn't seem to help very much. It came a time where I just gave up as I got older and I just didn't use them. I couldn't pick up the sounds or the sounds I did pick up, they were all muffled. So I, I gave up completely until, until I heard about the uh, bone breach. Music's pretty important to me. It's something I've done right from the beginning of life, really. It gives me a great deal of satisfaction, enjoyment. I love learning different instruments. My recent one is in the last five, six years is the violin. And that is one of the, I'm told, is one of the hardest ones to, to really try and grasp. It's something I, I wanted to do and I did it and I've been doing it now and I love it. I like playing with other people in different orchestras and things like that. And uh, that I find very satisfying. It is more enhanced. Um, I can, you know, see if I'm really out off pitch now, um, whereas before I wasn't, I wasn't quite hearing it. It's been exciting when I, I hear little things, like I was sitting at the computer and my partner came along and he was eating a banana. I could, I could hear him eating this, taking that bite and, the, and chewing. And I said, you're eating a banana. And I said, I'd like a bit of that, please. <laughs> I was surprised how, how I got back into the workplace or just doing my normal things, um, how, how good it felt and how quickly I adapted to it. It was really, really great. I work in an environment where there's a lot of people coming around you all the time wanting to know where certain places are. A lot of people have noticed how, how quick I've been at responding to the questions asked. It just makes it safer for me and for everybody else too. If I pick up other noises like beds going by or something like that, um, it, it really sort of helps. <laughs> I get out of the way. When you've got poor hearing and you've got environmental problems during the day, like wind, rain, whatever, and if you can't, if you haven't got that stereo hearing, you tend to um, not hear cars and, and a lot of things coming on your on the on your bad side. To cross roads and to have um, uh, cars coming on my right is it was a major a major problem for me. And when I wore a hearing aid, um, just a plain old hearing aid, the wind, the wind factor was just, it, whatever I tried never worked for me. It was just hopeless, absolutely hopeless. But as soon as I got a bone breach, well, it's just magic, absolutely magic. It really was. I, 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 it was one of the first things I commented on. I can, I can hear the cars coming on my right hand side and there's no wind, I can't hear the wind. I said, that's brilliant. So, you know, from then on I just, I was so wrapped because that was one of my, my major problems, um, you know, safety problems. It just added a lot of, um, a lot of confidence, gave me, made me feel good about, you know, what I was doing. So it was great, I loved it. <laughs>